Hey guys and welcome back to Let's Build with me, Engineered. And this episode we'll take a look at my latest creation, the drone caravan lifting a car. This one took many many hours to build and also many many hours to record because it's basically horrible to fly. Um, but as you can see the frames aren't too horrible, at least when I'm driving. Uh, I have 15 frames per second right now. But I think we'll just uh, park it here and I'll show you uh, how I built it. As you have uh, probably guessed, uh, I've used the same uh, glitch as I used in the um, Batmobile hiding a bat bike. Um, so I built this car first and then put the bearing underneath here and uh, from there I built the caravan connected to the car. So uh, here also I have to um, load a backup every time I'm gonna use it and I will uh, show you that later in the video. Now I will show you the insides of the caravan. Since this is the part of the build that flies it I needed a lot of thrusters and I wasn't sure I could have like a living area inside here uh, but I actually um, made it, so we have the bed, toilet, TV, kitchen, radio, fridge, yeah. And uh, obviously <laughs> it's a lot of thrusters here, uh, but it has to be that way. And I will explain that now. Uh, the first button activates one set of thrusters. And this is to make the caravan hover. So the four corners is the first set of thrusters. And then I need a second set of thrusters to lift the car. So these four is the hover thrusters when the car is dangling underneath. Uh, and then since it, well, it should be ho hovering, but uh, I think something went wrong, so it's actually takes off. Uh, but these thrusters... Oh, wrong way. Okay. So these thrusters here, this one and this one, is the thrusters I use to get the caravan up. And uh, the rest, oh yeah, and these two is to turn. And the rest is uh, connected to the gyro on top, so it keeps stable, or it should keep stable. But it's hard when the when the car is underneath. It's very hard to keep it stable, and that shows in the in the video where uh, yeah, I lose control. Mm, something else. Yeah, I've shown you the gyro before. Uh, if you go to the flying sightseeing bus, I show you how to build that one. It's the same. Uh, and we have the hook. Yeah, I will show you it. But first, let me uh, load the backup and uh, I can be connected. Okay, so this is what it looks like when I load the backup. And uh, you can see it much simpler than the Batmobile hiding the Batbike, because uh, this is the only link. So we remove it closest to the car first, and then the rest of them. Mm, the only thing I've changed from the showcase video is it was suggested to put something to center the caravan over the car. So these two hooks should push it to the center. Uh, we will try to get the caravan hooked on the car, uh, but I don't think we will make it because for the showcase video I tried it maybe 30 times before I made it. So let's try. Uh, as you can see the caravan isn't completely level so we ha need to have it uh, like there maybe ok 
Okay, we try that one. So, we release the little hook, then we release the big hook, then we start the gyro, then we activate the hover thrusters. And uh, it very carefully goes upwards. Much slower than last time, I must say. But okay. Then we release the hook. And then we try to get this thing. That was the front again. Okay, we can try to. As soon as I touch these thrusters. The Giru activates the other thrusters and it flies higher up. So this is the tricky part. Come on. Oh sh okay, let's try. Okay, we almost had it. But you get the point, and then there it goes. Okay. Where is this? Okay, here it comes. Put in the hook. Perfect. Yeah. <coughs> okay, I think we ended there. Um, tune in next time, and we uh, I show you how to build another one of my creations, or maybe a new one. So, yeah, see you guys.